Thursday things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday yeah Welcome to J-Hook Magic. I'm Jess. Thank you so much for coming and stumbling along my channel and wanting to hang out with me. I truly appreciate it. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. How art thou? How art thou? I hope all is well. Uh, if you haven't already and you'd be ever so kind, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when new videos have been posted. If it's not your first time here, welcome back my yarny friends ah it is things are making thursday things are making thursday things are making thursday yeah things are making thursday y'all know the drill it is a year-long process uh not process year-long collab <laughs> dang it <laughs> um that a bunch of us have uh Join together to pick a free crochet pattern, uh, come on every Thursday, show our progress, and then at the end of the month, show our final product, and it's amazing. This year, we're just doing it a little different. Uh, if you check down in the description box, you will see that we already picked out um, the theme or the pattern-ish type, whatever, <laughs> uh, what we will be doing uh, each month. You can pick any pattern you want. Uh, there's no specific one this year. Um, yeah, so it's so exciting. Also, go check out our Facebook page, Things We're Making Thursday. Uh, you get to see a lot of people's projects and uh, you can comment, question, make friends. It's a lot of fun. Uh, did I miss anything? Do, 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 do. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Just go in the description box and you'll have the link to the Facebook page and you can see all the different patterns that we have for each month if you would like to join along, which I think you should. Fix my blankie, I'm chilly. Speaking of blankie, February is the month of blankets. So we are doing blankets. Um, a lot of people love doing blankets. A lot of people don't. A lot of people don't have time for it or, you know, um, I was planning on making another star blanket, uh, but I just have not had time. So I reached out to my blanket queen, my mama. <laughs> she truly is the blanket queen. She can whip up a blanket like nobody's business. Um, and uh, every new baby gets one, which I think is amazing. Um, every married couple gets one. New home, you get one. I mean, she just, <coughs> oh, excuse me. She's like, oh my God, congratulations. What's your color scheme? Like, what's your color scheme? <laughs> That's her questions. Once she knows your color scheme, boom, she's knocking out a blanket. Next thing you know, you got one. And it's amazing because her blankets are so full of love and you could just feel it. Which she made this for me for my 40th birthday. And of course, it's in my favorite color. Let me get this up here. Ugh. Isn't it beautiful? And of course she sealed it with a kiss. Made with love, mom. Isn't she so cute? I love this blanket. It is nice and light. I think she, I think this is a mandala cake that she made this with. I'm not sure I'll have to ask her, but I keep this by my crochet desk. And when I get chilly, I, I throw this on me and I love it because it's like a hug from my mom. I love you, mom. <laughs> Anywho, speaking of my mom and the blanket queen, uh, I thought I could show you some of her blankets that she has uh, made. This 
trust me, this is not all of them. This is just ones that you can find pictures for. Because this lady just whips these blankets out like crazy. It's She's amazing. So I am just going to move over a little bit. So I'm just going to cuddle up in her blanket <laughs> and post some of her uh, blankets, uh, pictures of her blankets that she made right here. Um, a lot of them are uh, for new babies. Like, so she made them for like baby showers and stuff. Uh, one she made for uh, my dad's cousin for Christmas. Um, a lot of baby ones. And then one she did, uh, one of them, I don't remember which one, but she, she made the, uh, oh my gosh, it was a crochet along. Mm, I can't think of it. Anywho, I can't think of what it was, but it was a crochet along blanket and she, she whipped that thing up and I was like still 10 rows behind her. <laughs> I couldn't catch up. Um, and then she did, uh, an American flag one. Um, I forget who that was for. It might've been for a cousin. Not sure. Each one of my kids have one. My, oh, I should go get it. No, I don't feel like getting up. <laughs> it's going to be real, you guys. But she made my oldest daughter um, a blanket in all like these neon colors that my daughter picked out when she was five years old. She was five. And my mom made her this like big twin size blanket. And my daughter has had it on her bed since that day that she received the blanket. She is now 15, so that is 10 years. 10 years she has had this blanket, and just a few months ago, I had to fix just one little part on it because it uh, ripped, and I fixed it up, and you can't even tell. But I mean, 10 years, and I'm just having to just fix one little... Ugh. But she loves that blanket. It's her most cherished blanket, you know? Like she says, it's like a hug. They call her uh, Nan Nan. So it's like a hug from Nan Nan. And uh, my youngest has one. She has it up on her bed. And I don't think she made my son one. Hmm. Or did she? Oh, yes, yeah, she did. She made him a uh, blue and red one for Spider-Man. I think that one's in my truck. I like to keep some blankets in my uh, my vehicle, you know, just in case we get cold or you break down. You never know. Um, and then I got this one. She made us a blanket when my husband and I first got married. Uh, when we moved into our uh, first condo. Uh, what else? I'm telling you, this lady just makes everything. And she just went to a baby shower. Um, made the most beautiful blanket there. Uh, somebody had twins. She knocked out two blankets that were kind of similar, but a little bit different. Um, and now I believe she's working on one for a bridal shower. So like I said, she is busy, busy, nonstop. And once she knows your color scheme, that's it. You are getting one of the best gifts that you will receive. There's nothing is better than a crocheted item from someone who loves and cares about you and just wants nothing but the best, right? So, yeah. No blanket from me, but a lot from Mama. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll let you guys go. I can't wait to go and check out everyone else's blankets or what they're showing off. And uh, I'll hook up with you guys later. Bye. Thank you.